welcome back to my channel. My name is Dino Dan, and today we are making something else that's a DIY and probably not useful to most of you human beings, but <coughs> we are making DIY face masks. Yeah. So, so, so what you're gonna need is a container to mix it in. I know this is kind of small, but still, a mixer, a sponge applicator or any applicator, water, soap, um, any of your favorite scrubs. So I'm using this um, so fresh, so clean, awesome apricot cleansing pore scrub. And coin search. So first up, <coughs> you're going to take one pump of your hand soap. I have foaming hand soap, which is probably stupid. You should not use foaming hand soap because you need the actual soap piece. So one pump of it. This would be a small bit. Because that's going to foam up when you put it on your face. So you only need water if you cannot, if you are like not allowed to like pour this in. Because then it might be too watery. But if it's not watery enough, you can use the water. I need to freaking close this thing. There you go. And then you're going to mix this around by itself before you do anything else. Now, you're going to take your scrub and squeeze a bit of that in. And mix that around. And it should look something like this. Oh! Don't dump it like I did. Because now I have to clean this desk again. <coughs> and then you're going to take a pinch of coin starch. Pinch. Apparently, I don't know how to pinch, so yeah. And it's turning into like a dough consistency, which is what we want. Okay. I'm going to take a smallest dash of water. foaming up which is getting to, like you just have to have it be able to foam up a tiny bit before you start <sighs> okay so I know we already used the hand soap my foams so I'm gonna do a small little pump of it so like a whole pump of your hand soap, if it is foaming hand soap, which means that is going to probably overtake what you just made, which is probably going to make it look like this, which is what we are getting to, which means we're getting to the consistency of what we want. I'm going to take another pinch of your cornstarch, this time I'm doing a smaller pinch. Okay, I need the actual big pinch that I used to do that stuff. And let's 
getting there. I just want mine to be like really cleansing. Cornstarch actually helps with um face clean, like cleaning. Like baking soda and vinegar is like a really good cleaning thing. Cornstarch and water is oobleck, which makes cleaning stuff. So yeah. Okay, here we go. We got our consistency of the face mask. I know it's not normal face mask consistency, but that's because this isn't a normal freaking face mask. It's a DIY version. So suck it up, Bunko. <coughs> so, that's how you make a face mask. Um, if you guys want me to test this out, um, to let me know and I'll test it out in my next upcoming video, which is not going to be the next one. It's going to be later on tonight, where you're going to see me doing my night routine. Like, I've done my night routine for school. I'm going to do my night routine for summer. And then, I'm probably going to do another night routine for school, because I'm going into grade 8, so a different type of night routine. So, yeah. I'm also going to try to video in my school to, like, show around, so, yeah. I will see you guys in the next video. But before I end this, please comment, like, or dislike. Punch the subscribe button in the face. While you're at it, lightly tap the notifications bell so you don't hurt it. And so you can get notified when I make a new video. And my nose is being stuffy right now. I probably sound retarded. Bye.